What's going on guys? Before this video starts, I want to give a huge shout out to q Town Barbershop up here in Riverside. They're an amazing barbershop guys. They do everything, whether you need a liner because your hair's been looking a little rough, or you need a design to spice up your cut. They even wash hair guys. They do it all. So make sure you guys go to q Town Barbershop up in Riverside. I'll put their address right here and also go give Johnny the Barber a follow on Instagram. He works there. He's an amazing barber guys. He does it all. He's amazing. So make sure you guys go over there. Tell them NXL sent you. Maybe they'll hook you up, guys. So make sure you guys go over there once again. I'll put the address right here. Once again, Q-Top Barbershop up in Riverside. Go enjoy them. What's going on guys, it's your boy Next Level Gay back again with yet another banger and today, today's video is kind of different. I haven't done something like this on my channel before, but I feel like maybe the time is right, why not? I feel like it's interesting and I have a lot of guys on my channel, so females, I'm sorry. But if you do want to stay tuned, please do, it's going to be a fun video. Anyways guys, basically today I'm going to be doing a shoe collection video, my 2020 shoe collection. But I'm not showing all my shoes. I'm just going to be showing my top favorites and my new pickups. So I've basically been showing you guys like every time I get a new shoe, I post it on here. But I'm gonna just show you guys as a whole. I have about like I think about like six or seven shoes that I'm gonna be showing you guys. I think it's six. I don't know. But we're gonna get straight into the video. There's nothing more to talk about. Let's go. These right here, the Chucks. These are a clean shoe. I gotta say, I definitely gotta shout out my boy Zay for these. He gave me. He gave me this pair, and he also gave me this pair. My boy always hooking me up with some shoes, and these look crazy. Now, although I don't wear them a lot, when I do wear them, they do they do pop out for real. Like they just make the whole fit pop out. And the fact that I got like this color, the it's like an off white cream type of color, and then we got the the black right here. You could definitely wear them with like y'all know what I mean. Y'all could definitely wear them like one on one, mismatch them. They look good. My favorite part about this shoe though definitely has to be the orange inside like that's just such a subtle flex you don't see in a lot of shoes like most shoes just have like the classic black inside or white or gray this has orange that's what makes it stand out it looks crazy and they're also pretty comfortable too i know there's a whole bunch of like these chucks out here but these definitely are the most unique to me and look the best so zay i appreciate you for these bro that basically counts as two shoes so we we got to breeze through these i guess all right, the next shoe we have is, I want to show this one yet. Nah, I don't want to show this one yet. Y'all can't see the good ones already. I got to make y'all wait a little bit. Come on, y'all already know. All right, these are the Pine Green Jordan 1s. They came out a few months ago. I kind of forget. I don't know when they exactly came out. But I do know I got them for um resale price. I didn't get them on retail because I didn't even know when they dropped. I wasn't paying attention then. I don't know what I was doing at the time, but I didn't know when they dropped. So I had to come for retail. But these shoes right here, definitely one of my favorites out of my collection. Like I wear these a lot. As you can see, they a little creased. Yeah, I know. They're not that bad. Like, but it's only this shoe. Like, this one's not creased as much, or is it? I don't know, but I really beat down these shoes. I wear them all the time. And the fact that they come with the um, the red, I just took these out, that's why they're like this. But the fact that they come with the red laces and then the red tongue right there, like that combination just goes crazy. It's like when you have the red laces on here, or maybe on like one shoe, that's how I had it. I had the red laces on one shoe and I had the other pair on black. You can just like wear a red hoodie with that, with some black cargo pants and you, you, know, you flee. You really flee. That's why I wore these a lot. And I think Jordan 1s are my favorite type of shoe. Not my favorite Jordan, but they are my favorite type of shoe. But yeah, definitely. These the pine green ones, baby. This has to be probably my top. Top four? I don't know. I don't know. Because what I'm looking down here, I don't know. But it's definitely the top five. Definitely the top five, for sure. Okay, I guess we'll do these next, since you guys already seen these like in my like two videos ago. Y'all probably know what these are. I already started wearing them like crazy. These are the Jordan 11 Jubilees, as y'all can see. 
man. These when I tell you these shoes are crazy, it's crazy because I never liked the 11s out of the Jordan collection. I never liked the 11s ever. And the fact that I accidentally won these shoes, y'all. If y'all didn't watch that video, go watch that right now. I told you guys how I won these shoes, and it's crazy. They still got that. Oh, they still got the fresh shoes smelling them. Oh. They smell so good. Take a sniff. I'm doing so good. Man, I love. Right now, these are my favorite pairs of shoes, and it's crazy to think that a shoe that I never liked is now my favorite pair. It's pretty crazy. Yeah. These are definitely cool. They're comfortable too. Like this is how I lace them up. I don't really do to go too crazy with my lacing. I just knotted them up like that. Had them a little loose fit. But yeah, that's how I find them the most comfortable. My favorite part about the shoe is that right there. That Jordan signed away. Oh, that looks so good. Man, these shoes are crazy. And the box, bro, the box is the best part. Like, never have I ever seen a box like this. It just looks good. Like, it almost gives you, oh my gosh. Like, it almost gives me like a futuristic look, feel me? I don't know, maybe it's just me, but I just love the way the box is. Guess the shoe. Comment down below and guess the shoe. Y'all not gonna do it. I already know y'all not gonna do it. But these are the Fire Red Fours. Now these are also, mm, I'd say currently, like currently, these are my second favorite shoes. I just got them about a couple weeks ago from my boy Gavin. Shout out Gavin, bro. It's my shoe plug right there, for real. Always got what I need. I'll put this little at right here or something like that. But yeah, these shoes are, oh my gosh, man. The crazy thing about these shoes is like, at first I wasn't gonna get them, and then I changed my mind. But the only reason I changed my mind was because, literally, ever since middle school, Jordan 4s like, was like the, sh the shoe, the dream shoe. The shoe that I always wanted. I think it was the Oreos. I fiend over them Oreos, man. I wanted them so bad, but I never got them. All these years passed, forgot about Jordan 4s, completely focused on the ones. And then I seen these come out, and I was like, oh my gosh. At first I passed on them just for a few reasons, but then I was like, you know what, I have to. I have to treat myself. I always wanted a pair of fours. Red is my favorite color, so I was like, you know what, I'm gonna just pull the trigger. So I pulled the trigger and I bought this shoe, and this is what we got, man. They look so good, like, the bottom, everything just looks good, it's a color scheme. Some people don't like them because they say there's too much white showing, but like, I thought the same thing looking at it online, but like, seeing it, having it in hands, in per damn, bro. Oh my gosh, recording videos. Man, what y'all like? Bro, these y'all look crazy, guys. Girl. Damn. Bro, these shoes is raw. Yo, let me hold those for you real quick. What you mean, bro? You like wear it tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> On to the last pair of shoes. Ooh, let's go. Here, y'all probably already know what it is if y'all watch my videos. These are... The Jordan 1 mochas, ooh, they look so good. They look so good, but let me tell y'all something. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. These shoes kind of hard to match with. Like I, 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 like, I looked in my closet, and I don't think I have anything that would actually like make these pop, so I have to go shopping soon for these, because I'm, I'm not finna just wear them anything. But a lot of people have these shoes, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I got these about, what'd I say, a month ago, maybe? I probably, I think I got these like a month ago about a month ago and I still haven't worn them yet. They just been sitting in my closet. Look, not a single crease, nothing. My favorite part about this shoe is this white right here. Cause it's not even white, it's like a like a off, not even like an off white, it's like a cream looking color. And it just, I don't know, it just complements this smoker looking so good. I love this shoe. Is it my favorite? Mm, no, it's not my favorite. Dang, that snow is crazy. Like at first, I didn't want the shoe at all, but I seen the hype on the shoe. I saw the re I saw the resale price, so that's when I tried to. Um, I remember the story time where I tried to get them on the raffle. And I didn't get them like three times, and I got them on my fourth try. So yeah, I got them. I don't know if I want to resell them yet or keep them, cause I honestly haven't decided. I haven't even worn them yet. Only time I wore them was to try them on. So I don't know. Yeah, that's the Jordan One Mochas. Hopefully, I find a fit to wear them soon and post them on the gram. 
be yeah, these shoes are something else, man. They're really they're just different. That's what they are. They're different. But guys, that is my sneaker collection. Not my sneaker collection. It's just my favorite shoe. I got more shoes up there, but you know they not they not top tier. You know they not. I don't wear them like that. I only wear I don't wear a lot of shoes. You know, but I just lied. I do wear a lot of shoes. <laughs> But these are my favorite shoes as of right now in 2020. Who knows what I'll have in 2021. But if y'all want to see another shoe collection video, make sure you comment down below. And I'll make sure I'll do some when I get some new cops. Maybe show my other shoes too in 2021. Who knows? But guys, that's basically it. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And it's your boy, Next Level Gabe. And I'll catch y'all later. I didn't even cover it. I don't want to hit the camera and fall back.